toilet is everyday essential place to go. You wash your hands, you bath yourself, you take a dump, and even the smallest thing like throwing your trash, you will go there to satisfy your needs. But there is something that we must know about Fong Chia's toilet. We see that the toilet is not in a good condition, the trash can is so full, and there is a lot of pees and often menstruation's blood too, running out of tissue, unpleasant smell is everywhere, and many other things that make us so disappointed with this condition, especially for female toilet. So, let's hear some words about Fong Jia's toilet. Hi, I'm Hansen. I'm the third year of the uh, Department of Computer Science and Electrical Engineering. Hello, my name is Patrick Cohen. Uh, I'm uh, a second year student in Feng Chai University, uh, international business student. Hi, my name is Jing Shen. I'm from International Business Department. Hi, my name is Belinda Gracia and I'm a second year business student in Feng Chai University. On the weekdays, uh, I use probably like three times a day, but when I drank a lot, probably like five, six, seven, yeah. Yes, uh, twice a day. Once a day? Yes, because I'm an active student and maybe two, twice a day. But the toilet in Phong Chia, especially in my department, the fourth and fifth floor is very good. But for the rest, it's okay. The smell is really bad. Very dirty and stinky. Uh, smelly, dirty, and uncomfortable for me. There are three urinoirs, and there's two of them that's clogged, and it's kind of full of pee. And another one, it's on maintenance, so there's no place to go to the toilet. Other than the smell uh, it's pretty okay there's no toilet paper inside and the floor is very slippery and sometimes there is some toilet papers on the floor there is one time when I was going to use the toilet but it's just too smelly to be true and I almost throw up and then I hold it I hold it up and then I just went home and I just used my own toilet Every toilet will look like the 4th and 5th floor of electrical engineering building. Uh, it can be more clean and less smelly. I wish for the janitor, please pay more attention to the toilet's condition. And for some people and for all the people who use the toilet, please flush the toilet. Thank you. We barely assume that Fong Chia's toilet is awful. But in fact, not all of the toilets are bad. We see in the Renyan and Sutian buildings, the toilets are decent. The environment is clean, it is not too smelly, and actually, it's not that bad. So now we're at the computer science building and we will look at the toilet condition. So we can see here, the toilet condition is pretty good. There is a ventilation. There's some ventilation. The lightning is pretty good. And for the sink or wash towel, it has two different options to wash your hand. Either you want to use the soap dispenser or you can use like the more traditional soap. And now we get we will like to test the oh it's working. And now we're going to see the inside. For me, it's pretty... No, no, no. It's wonderful. It has no sand. The garbage is clear. So if you feel uncomfortable to use tissue to wipe your private area, here, the toilet has some bidets. You can see there. And they have the seat toilet too. And now... The question is, who is responsible for all these problems? Is it only the school and the janitor? 
are, we also participate in this. Don't just blame others, reflect on it.